Halftime in DeKalb, Northern Illinois, and their home opener leading Western Illinois by a score of 28 to 7. Jim Blaney here at halftime, and I'm joined by the president of Northern Illinois University, Dr. John Peters. And we're enjoying a football game oh, yeah. here, but I think it's important for the fans to hear a little bit about what's going on with education in the state of Illinois because what happens at public universities like Northern Illinois, like Western Illinois for that matter, is greatly impacted by what happens in Springfield and yes. the budget impasse over the summer is really causing some difficulties in budgeting. Can you explain a little bit about that? Yeah, particularly our oldest aid program for our neediest students, the monetary award program, the MAP program. There's 137,000 recipients, and there was another 130,000 who, who uh, wanted aid but missed the deadline. And what has happened because of our budget situation, that money has been cut in half. So there's 137,000 students right now at universities who will not who has who have funding for this semester, but in the spring it drops to zero. It drops off the table. And it's not just the public institutions, it's also the private institutions. Loyola and DePaul, all of us, 137,000 students. And unless uh, something happens in Springfield uh, in the fall during veto session to put that back, we stand the chance of having 137,000 students leave uh, their educational experience. I can't think of anything that would have more of a negative impact on our state long term and our economy. And just to clarify that 137,000 students, that's all across the state of Illinois, correct? That's all across the state of Illinois. At our institution, NIU, we have 5,000 of our 18,000 freshmen that have some sort of MAP money, and many of them have the full amount. Uh, uh, this is true of every university, both public and private, and the community colleges. To wrap up our conversation, there's a website for Save Illinois Map Grants. Tell us a little bit about it. Yeah, it's a, a Save Illinois uh, uh, a website, Map Grants, and uh, people should go there and register their opinion and contact their representatives and tell them how important this is. It's a crisis that if it is not fixed in October, we can't wait till January because students register for school uh, in November and they need to know that they're going to have financial aid. Dr. Peters, thanks for your time, and thanks for playing host on us tonight. We really appreciate it. Dr. John Peters, president of Northern Illinois University, his school, Northern Illinois, leading at the half, 28-7 over Western Illinois. Dave and Bob are back with first-half highlights right after this timeout.